everyone, it's Mai, and today I'm going to be doing a short haul for you guys. And the three places is Ulta, Forever 21, and Sephora. So it's kind of um, like makeup, and I have one clothing item that I got. So I'll just start with Forever 21. Oh, it's this way. Forever 21. Okay, so the first thing I got from Forever 21, actually, the, oh no, I actually got a couple things from there, um, is this really cute crop top. It's so cute, I'm obsessed with it. And it looks like this. It says run wild. And then there's like a car on it right there. So it's really, really, really cute. And it's a crop top. So I'd wear it with high waisted shorts and stuff like that. And yeah, so that's the first thing. The second thing that I purchased at Forever 21 were these sunglasses. And Forever 21 actually has amazing sunglasses like right now. And literally they're so cheap and you should check them out. These are only like $5. And look, they look like this. And I kind of like them. I'm having like a sunglass phase. Like I'm kind of obsessed with sunglasses right now. I don't know. But I really like these and they're really cute. And they have kind of like the um, leopardish print over here. So I think that's really cute. And then the last thing from Forever 21 was this really cute, um, what are they called? Knuckle ring set. And I like, my friend found them for me. And they look like this. I'll like put them on my finger. So they look like that. And they're just stackable. Um, knuckle rings that you wear on your fingers and I would probably wear like one or two at a time not all of them because they're a little too crowded but yeah um these were 180 so that's really really cheap okay so the next place I went to was Ulta and I got a couple things so the first thing I got was the pst, pst, <laughs> dry shampoo and this one was on sale so it was really cheap and it looks like this and I heard really good things about this dry shampoo, and I've actually never tried dry shampoo before. Well, actually, no. I tried the Tresemme one, but it was really bad. It made my hair all white looking. And I heard this one was really good, so I'm excited to try this. And this is also in the mini size. So, that's just, I like everything mini size that I realized. So, yeah. Um, the next thing... Let's take everything out. Um, the next thing I got was the NYX Natural um, the eyeshadow palette with one, two, three, four, five, six colors. And it looks like this. And I've heard really good things about this one. I heard that this is not, it's obviously not a dupe for the Naked Palette, but it has really similar colors. And if you're looking for that natural look for really cheap, this is only $6. It's really good. And I will show you all of the colors. So it looks like that. And all of them are really, really pretty. There's a mix of mattes, and then there's also a mix of um, the shimmery eyeshadow colors. So I really, really love this. And... Um, actually, the eyeshadow that I have on today is using these colors, so, yep. Um, that is that. And then the next thing I got from NYX was, I was looking for an under-eye concealer, so I heard this one was really good. It's called Above and Beyond Full Coverage Concealer by NYX, and I'm in the color Fair. And it looks like, well, that's the name of it, and it looks like this. And if I open it, I use a little today, too, and it looks like that. But the good thing about this is that I it has really good f coverage, like the name says. But also, I use the color shader, uh, a shader lighter, <laughs> a shade lighter than my normal skin tone because I like when my eyes look nice and bright, and it gets rid of my under eye circles. So this is really good, and you guys should definitely try this out. And then the last place that I went to was Sephora, and I usually don't go to Sephora, but I was having a Sephora mood. So anyway, the first thing I wanted to get was the Laura Mercier Tinted Moisturizer in SPF 20, and I'm in the color Nude, and everyone on YouTube probably is very familiar with this product because it's just very well known, and it's really good, and I tried a little bit of it, and for me, it's a little bit too lightweight coverage, but I think it would be really good, ooh, oh my god. I think it would be really good if I use this in the summertime and just have a very like fresh face and I really like it and it's really nice and light and it also moisturizes your skin really well and SPF 20 definitely does a lot. And the next thing, um, I was kind of like into the whole trying to find new um, uh, foundations and stuff like that so I asked them if I could have samples of a couple of them. So I got two sample ones. So the first sample I got is the Makeup Forever HD Foundation. And the reason why I wanted to get this foundation is because my prom is coming up. And I wanted to have a foundation that makes you really, like, HD ready and very, like, clear. So that is the Makeup Forever 21 one. Wait, Makeup Forever 21? No. Oh my god, Makeup Forever HD Foundation. And I'm in the number 127. 
and they gave me something that looks like this and it's actually a lot it looks like that so yeah it's just kind of like a sample size and this is good because I'm not sure if I'm gonna like it I don't know how it looks on me and I wouldn't want to buy the whole entire thing now so that is really good and then the next one I got was the Tarte Amazonian clay foundation and I got it in the color light but I tried it a little bit but I think it's a little bit too light for me but yeah they gave me a lot less of it but yeah it um, I kind of like it though but it's a little bit thick but it's also kind of a little bit light for my skin so maybe next time I'm gonna try it. I think it's a light medium is the next color. So yeah. Um uh I think that's it. Also, I was really like trying to look for um benefit products because I'm having like a benefit obsession. Like I don't know what's wrong with me. I just I just want everything that's benefit. Anyway, and because I, I have all the benefit like mini sizes and stuff like that. So also, I remember when I was there, I just like all of a sudden remembered that it's my birthday month because my birthday is in May and I went today, which is in May, and I, they if you if it's your birthday month they give you like a little free gift and stuff like that so I received benefits real birthday turn-ons it's a beauty insider you have to be a beauty insider member in Sephora it's like you just have to have one of those cards and you guys should definitely do it because it's free to sign up for it and yeah so it looks like this and oh my gosh I was looking for a mini Watts up like oh my god and then the their real lash it the their real mascara which is like one of their most popular ones and the brush on this is phenomenal like the top is like pointed like that and the what's up is amazing and I'm actually I use the what's up today over here and on my brow bone and I also use the their real lash mascara the what's up is like really cute and really tiny but honestly it's so worth it like just trying it out and stuff like that and it looks like that and yeah so you kind of I just put it on here and this is really good for like a bronzy like glow because it's nice and shimmery and also, um, I got the Their Real Mascara, so it looks like that, and this brush, oh my gosh, I'm obsessed with it. If you look at the top, see how it's like, has the spikes on the top? That just makes it so much easier for you to like, get into that little corner. Oh my god, I'm like obsessed, I can't even, <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with me, I'm obsessed with Benefit. And yeah. So yeah, that was just a really quick haul that I did for you guys. I hope you guys liked it. And if you want to know any more information about all the products that I got, you can message me on Facebook, uh, not Facebook, message me on Twitter or like message me through YouTube and ask me how I like them or I'll just tell you guys and I'll keep you updated. And you can follow my Twitter and Instagram down below. And Twitter and Instagram is where I do most of my um, social networking and stuff like that. So yeah, I hope you guys liked it. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.